Hi, Chris Ox. Hi, so uh, my name is Samuel McGregor and oh, hey, 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 Susie, chill, chill the fuck out. So I'm, uh, I'm a chicken lover, as you can see, and this is Susie. She's a, well, she's just a great girl, and uh, this is where we live. This is where we hang out. This is a family. Okay, go, go, go. Get out of here. And uh, yeah, so. Basically, I've been living here for pretty much my whole life. These are my chickens, they're my friends, and they're my family. This is just basically, this is how they keep cool, you know? You kind of just get in there. Ah, nice and cool. Come here, guys. Come here, buddy. Come here, Rob. That's Robbie. He's a, well, he's a she, um, I think. I can't really tell. Yeah, I don't know, we kind of just hang out all day. You know, kind of do kid stuff, just just hang around. Kind of get nutty sometimes, you know? These are the bunnies. Uh, I actually haven't named them yet because uh, they all look the same. Hey, hi. Hey, little rabbit. Hi, uh, you rabbit. I wish you were good. That's how we talk. Just, it's like a... I do my I do my voice and they kind of they have their own kind of voice that they do. Don't be scared. I'm not gonna eat you yet. No, we do eat them though. Uh, the grain on the barbecue, a little bit of ibuku sauce and ketchup, and you're rolling. But yeah, this guy, he's a little cutie. Oh, I'm not gonna hurt you, little buddy. He loves to play. They just love it. They love when I make the voice with them because they, it's kind of a way that we can connect, you know? Because we're like, we're both animals, essentially. Uh, they're a little furrier than me. <laughs> In some places. But I hear it's pretty cool. What else we got? Oh, nail. Ouch. This is where I do my chin ups. Gotta stay fit with the guys, you know what I mean? With the gang. That's basically how we, we kind of stay fit around here. This push-ups, a lot of Plyometric using our body weights. Yeah, that's about it. Uh, sometimes these are big. Giving me some tid. I'll get that. <laughs> you know, just, just to around though. They're pretty good, but oh man, 6 a.m. wake up call. Tony and the gang. Whew. Every morning. Yeah, so that's where we're at. This is the, legitimately, this is the, the best way to spend an afternoon. Oh my God. Tina, look at this pose from, look, look at it. Yeah, that's exactly, that's what she wore last night. What a stupid outfit. Oh my God. <coughs> what I do for fun outside of hanging with chickens? Not, I, not much really, just, Smoke a lot of weed, yeah. A lot of, ton of weed. I've pretty much domesticated some of the most ferocious creatures in the in the galaxy, essentially. Have you seen the talons on these guys? It's vastly superior to that of any other earthly creature. There's a lot of domestic abuse, but that's that's it's natural, you know. It's like any other relationship. There's always abuse and. Essentially, that's where I come in and kind of break things off. Hey, leave her alone! Leave her alone! I'm just, you know, doing my job as a, as a father and watching over my kids, you know? They're the great kids.
<laughs> I think some people forget what what's really about being a a chicken guy. Sometimes I'll say, uh, I, I'm not much of a singer, but this is love for it. also where I practice my yoga. It's all about the breathing. It's a downward dog. Spread the fingers, you'll notice the difference. Really opens up her back. And now it's a child's pose. <sighs> right on the spot, get the heart going. Flap those wings, nice and wide. Stretch the chest out. There you go, some wind bells. Alternating wind bells. There we go. Well, I think we'll call it a day.